Hello everyone, welcome to Learning Python. So in the last session we were discussing how you know we can use different kind of t-test to figure out you know whether the uh, <coughs> mean is same or not. In this uh, you know uh, exercise we will use uh, case test which is to figure out whether two data set they come from the same distribution or not. We can do here also different kind of test. We can check let's say you know, there is a random variable code x if it's coming from normal distribution or not. So in that in that in that case, we compare you know the theoretical distribution with the empirical data, or also we can compare two data set let's say x and y, and figure out you know if they come from the same uh, distribution or not. So we will import NumPy library. We will import uh, scientific Python library, which has you know statistics sub library, and call it st and let's run it so we are generating thousand normally distributed standard you know uh, uh, normal distributed random variable and we will apply the case test over it so it's called you know very simple function case test we define our data and we are checking whether it's following normal distribution or not we look at the value of p so we are getting higher value than the threshold and you know of course we generated normal distribution so we got the uh, data is it's telling the it's following normal distribution let's try to do it with less number of data set it's telling it's following normal distribution at the threshold of 0 0.05 if you want you know you can do multiple iteration and then see how many time it's following and it, how many time it's not following sometime it will happen that it will show you know the incorrect thing though it's coming from normal distribution but it's showing it's not falling and that's part of the game you know because we know there are the different kind of error which will uh, creep in so now in the second example what we are doing intentionally we are generating uniformly distributed you know random variable and checking whether it's following normal distribution or not we expect it will say no and then it's showing the result because uniform distribution has flat pdf and in the normal distribution PDF is uh, symmetric in both the cases, uniform and normal distribution, but it's the bell shaped curve. We have more mass in the middle, and it, they are very different, so it's you know clearly telling. Now we can do one more test to see whether whether x and y come from the same distribution or not. We'll print d, we'll print p. We know x is you know uh, normally distributed, y is uniformly distributed. So we can see value of p is uh, p is still higher than the threshold. Let's run all. So it's lower than the threshold. So there are sometimes chances you know it's telling they are same or not. So you can figure out you run it multiple times and then see how many times you are right or wrong. In aesthetics, you know, just one chance result does not make, you know, uh, uh, much sense. So you can try different time and then you can rely, yes, this looks, you know, sensible. The D, D aesthetics is about, you know, the maximum difference we get between both the PDF. You should read more about the case test, you know, theoretically you can go to any uh, Google, you can search in any of the aesthetics, you know, in the standard aesthetics books, you will find about the case test. So run, read a bit theoretical background about it and then you generate some different kind of distribution different kind of random number play around it and see what is the strength what is the weakness of this tense and you know then you can appreciate where to use this test where not to use how much conclusion you can draw up to what extent you go with this so thank you in this session and then see you in the next session